All right, guys, how's it going? Well, we're going to be talking about some breaking news that I've seen some of you guys talking about uh, in the last few minutes, literally just like that, just a few minutes ago. Just, just, just like that. So yeah, if you're young, you won't know what that's about. Um, and these are the, it's important to, to touch on this because I want you to know where this originates from. Should you, uh, at some point today, hear um, these claims? Now... What we're going to have to do. So first of all, the claims are along the lines of, you know, um, well, let's start with, let's start with like an innocent tweet, for example, here. Uh, this account here, um, not a bad account, you know, a fan, um, you know, nice enough person fo fo follows me and, and vice versa. I think I follow them even, to be honest with you. Um, but it is an account that puts out Liverpool news and claims. And this account, for example, says breaking. And they've used one of them emojis for a, you know, flashing red light. Do you know what I mean? Serious business and that. Breaking. Report suggests Liverpool is finalising a deal to bring Xavi Alonso back uh, behind the scenes. Looks like a succession plan for Klopp's departure is in the works. Right? So that's the claim. Right? But it doesn't say... You know, it says reports suggest. So the first thing I want to know is, okay, well, who's suggesting that? What reports? So this was posted at 11 a.m. this morning, okay? If we go to this post here, uh, which was posted at, uh, let me click on it. I'm going to click on it. All right, just a, just a minute. I'm good with my fingers. <clears throat> I'm going to go to old finger blast. Right, uh, that was posted at 10.22. So 40 minutes, 38 minutes earlier, this appears to have set off the, the, the you know, the, 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 the chatter. This is coming from the transfer room, which is absolutely horrendous. Uh, and, and this individual isn't someone that I would pay attention to. Uh, and their claim is Liverpool are reportedly in the process of finalising a deal to appoint Xavi Alonso Quote, behind the scenes, as they develop a succession plan for Jurgen Klopp's impending departure, which was announced in January. And then that has the link to the article, which we're going to go over. So key points here, finalising a deal, reportedly, behind the scenes, uh, develop a succession plan, impending departure. Right? So you can see that, that text. Now, that was posted at 10.22, but at 11am here, we have this other account saying, remember the key words? Uh, report suggests behind the scenes succession plan, uh, Klopp's departure. Basic. So this is basically, in my opinion, 11 a.m. It's come from this at 10:22 a.m. Right. So there's be some people watching this saying, "Well, what does it matter?" Well, it does matter because you know you fans start commenting and believing this stuff. Do you know what I mean? And uh, we're going to look at it to see if you should um, pay attention to it. Right. Uh, if you don't like videos like this, fine, don't. But I do know some people, you know, don't watch it. I do know that some people uh, like to see where these claims come from. So we're going to dismiss it. That's what I think we're going to do. Because this, the original account, or one of the original accounts, is linking us to an article that they've posted, they're promoting uh, on the transferroom.com, which is horrendous. So well, what we do with that is... Um, the transferroom.com. Right, let's let's load up the article. Oh, I did that earlier because I'm very professional. So here's the article. Uh, Liverpool working on deal to appoint Javi Alonso, quote, behind the scenes. And the first sentence is, blah, blah, blah. Uh, this is what we just discussed. According to Football Insider. So now we've got to go to someone else. So we've got Transfer Room that just so happen want us to go and visit Football Insider as well, which is absolutely garbage. And what we'll do is we will take a look at said article on Football Insider, which is a website that you should never pay attention to, right? So some people might think, well, why are we discussing it if we should never pay attention to? Because if you read this one, this says, you know, this is a bold claim, right? You know, reports suggest that we're finalising a deal, talks behind the scenes, blah, 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 but doesn't say where it's come from. So I think it's important that people know where these things come from, because if that had originated from a tweet by Fabrizio Romano, people would be like, fucking hell, that's worth paying attention to. Do you get me drift? So we're just going to look at how these things start, because now I know that people all over are now repeating that this is what's happening. So let's look at the, the claims 
to see if we believe them. Me and you together, I've briefly gone through this, but we're gonna go through it right now in this video, right? To see if we should believe this, this uh, publication, Football Insider. Here's the headline, Liverpool Next Manager, right? It's about the Liverpool Next Manager. Major update. Now, not just an update, but a major update, right? So bear that in mind when we read what's claimed. Major update on Javi Alonso, appointment, as new talks revealed, right? So we're looking for some revelations here. It's major, major update, right? So let's have a look. Um, this is by this chap, Wayne Vesey. We see him all the time. And usually every article starts with, like we uh, exclusively revealed on, and then includes the date, because that gives you, you know what I mean? Like we, we, we told you about this before. I don't know if he says this yet, but it's usually within the first or second paragraph by this person on this website. Liverpool are still hopeful of agreeing a deal to bring Alonso to the club, despite reports claiming he is likely to join Bayern Munich if he leaves Bayer Leverkusen. Well, we know where those claims came from, don't we? Uh, that was uh, Florian Plettenberg. We did a, a video on here the other day about it, who is a mouthpiece for Bayern Munich. So immediately you should be suspicious of that. Um, so uh, let me restart. Liverpool is still hopeful of agreeing a deal to bring Xabi Alonso to the club despite reports claiming he is likely to join Bayern Munich if he leaves Bayer Leverkusen. Sources, this bit's in capital letters, uh, not capital letters, bold fonts. Sources have told Football Insider, fucking serious business. Second paragraph. Sky Sports reported last week, 22nd of March, so it's not, they're not saying that we said it, but they, do it, they, they always do this with the dates, that Alonso, 42, prefers a move to the Alliance Arena over Anfield if he is to leave uh, Bundesliga leaders uh, Leverkusen. I don't really want to click through to this, but it's given it a bit more strength, what this journalist is trying to, you know, Sky Sports reported last week that Alonso prefers the Alliance Arena, right? But it's not actually factually, it's not really true. It, it's It's... It's, it's bending the truth a bit because that article is is making it sound like a second bit of, you know, strength, if you like, because, you know, we, we, we've been told that by, he will go to Bayern Munich if he leaves uh, Leverkusen. That was Florian Plettenberg. He, he, this person, this journalist now says Sky Sports reported last week that Alonso prefers to move to the Alliance Arena. It's not true. It was Florian Plettenberg, again, because I just clicked on the article and went through to it, Right. But if you don't pay, you know, if you don't pay attention to these things, it's like, oh, that sounds okay. Sky Sports are saying it because some people really believe, or well, not believe. Some people really pay attention to what Sky Sports say. They'd be the last people I would pay attention to. No offense, guys. Great for access and interviews and all that. Do you know what I mean? We have them on here in the back. But that's on still pause. The only reason is on still pause, so it looks good. When you're not here, I'll have some filth on there or something like that. You know what I mean? Just makes it look like I know what I'm doing. I won't listen to these fucking idiots. Anyway, the man. They're usually the last to know. If you want to know the truth, Sky Sports, all they do is follow the likes of Ornstein uh, and Born Again Joyce, since uh, Edwards is back within the organisation. Uh, and then, within minutes of a claim by them, they will put it on there saying Sky Sports news sources. When really, it's just someone like me sat in a fucking you know office on, on a fucking YTS with the same fucking... You've seen the monitors behind? You know, I just... I do this for your benefit, to keep an eye on you guys. Do you know what I mean? I don't come on here, read something that's claimed by these numpses and then go, cop talk sources say that, uh, you know, a lot. Just, you know what I mean? So don't pay attention to Sky Sports. Not very much. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, uh, however, the Spaniard remains a top target for Liverpool ahead of Jurgen Klopp's summer exit and a well-placed source. Well-placed source is to give it even more strength. It's to make you believe. Well, if it's a well-placed source, why not just a source? The emphasis is on well-placed. So the first three paragraphs are, this, this, you should believe this, believe this, believe this. Right? You know what I'm saying? A well-placed source has told Football Insider that the Reds are ready to break the bank to get him. Who believes that shite? FSG are going to break the bank to get... No, they're fucking not. No, they're not. What FSG are going to do, and rightly so, is appoint who they think will be the best manager for Liverpool Football Club having consulted with the people that they've employed to run the football club and the football organisation, and they will make a decision based on merit, potential, 
Finances will come into it, but they aren't just going to break the bank to get Xabi Alonso. At the end of the day, Alonso, do you want a job? You've been offered a job to manage one of the greatest football clubs in the fucking world. We're not going to beg you to come and do it. It's just absolute nonsense. The Merseysiders haven't given up on luring their former midfielder back to Anfield in the off-season. No, they haven't. It's common sense. But Liverpool, this is a bit now, you see the bits that these, these accounts are telling you. Look, what was it, sir? Back behind the scenes, right? We need to look for the behind the scenes bit. Liverpool are working on a deal to appoint Alonso behind the scenes. Well, they're not going to fucking work on a deal in public, are they? Right? Do you know what I mean? Okay. As they draw up the succession plan ahead of Klopp's exit. Come on. Do you know what I mean? The succession plan was fucking underway in 2023. Ultimately, the Mercedes... Uh, the Merseysiders recognise that the decision will come down to the Spaniard. Is it is effectively his job if he wants it? Yeah, but they aren't going to kiss his ass. They're not going to kiss his... Liverpool, even these owners, whether you like them or not, they ain't going to... fuck. This is Liverpool football club. You turn down Liverpool, then you fucking you won't get a chance again, in my opinion. That's what... If Liverpool really want him, you know what I'm saying? Liverpool are interviewing other targets. No, they're not. They're not interviewing anybody. And have fallback, have fallback plans in case Alonso turns them down. No shit. You mean that the owners are bright enough to consider other options should they be unable to recruit any of their primary targets? Really? Now, in bold, <clears throat> Liverpool working on Alonso appointment despite new Bayern Munich claim. It's not a new claim regarding Bayern Munich. And I guarantee you this is to do with Florian Plettenberg. The Spaniard has uh, his Leverkusen side sitting top of the Bundesliga and is on course to win a historic treble with the German side this season. He blah, blah, blah. He's just, you know, considered one of the world's most exciting new managers. Tells you about his contract. Blah, blah, blah. We don't need to read all that. Bayern Munich, who are rivaling Liverpool for Alonso, are set to a part, you know, part company with blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. So, the the... The, the 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 bit here, Liverpool working on Alonso appointment despite new Bayern Munich claim. They don't even they don't even touch on it. So what that means is, despite the claims that we tried to feed you at the beginning of the article, uh, which really comes from Florian Plettenberg, which is really just to try and lure you in. Now again, I know some of you watching this, especially the smart asses, the casual viewers that come in and say, "Well, why are we talking about clickbait? You know, why are we doing that?" So that people know where this shit comes from. Do you know what I mean? Because this. This is a this is you know this has been viewed hundreds of times already. I've not even refreshed it, but it doesn't tell you where it comes from. But then we can go down to this fucking idiot here and this shite site that one where well, they want you to click through to another one. And before you know, before the end of the day, people get misled by this. So I'm trying to help my friends because the majority of people watching videos here consider themselves my friends, right? And this is this is a community. I make videos for the people that enjoy the cop talk fucking website and everything behind me, right? So we're not here to fucking please you fucking casual viewers that are coming in just because it's got something in the fucking title of the video. They, you, you read the comment section, you know what I'm saying? My, 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 my aim here is to, to monitor the good and the bad and say, yeah, I think we should pay attention to this or we should ignore that. And to tell people where these claims come from. Because on the members' website here, this, this isn't called the VIP members' website for no fucking reason, right? People come on here and they might say, oh, I've heard, you know, such and such. And then we collectively say, ah, it's come from such and such. And you can either then say, oh, that's interesting, or it's a load of shite. Do you know what I mean? So this account, to be honest with you, I, you know what I mean? The, uh, it's just not helpful if you're not telling people where it's coming from. That, that's my opinion. I don't think the... I don't know. I ain't got an opinion on it. I don't care if it upsets anybody anyway. So my, my, my aim here is to look after the people that support me and watch my videos and are part of my fucking community. You know what I'm saying? That's it. That's where it's all come from. So if you hear those claims today that Liverpool, are, you know, you'll hear the key words, working on a deal behind the scenes. What else was it? Finalising a deal. Finalising. You might hear someone say that because you know you get numpties that follow this that then go on their own personal Facebook accounts that are not aggregators, they're not trying to lure anybody in, that tell their friends... Liverpool finalising on a deal, you know. Oh, yeah, how do you know that? That's just my source has told me. Which really is someone just sat in a fucking flat at home, do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Bed sit, something like that, or knocking one fucking out somewhere. You know, because they do my editing. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, that's it. Passionate video right there for you. That's it. What time is it? 25 past 11. <clears throat> mm. I can't even go and get any, uh, any group. Won't do you any harm, you f I know, I know, I know. I'm trying my best, trying my best. Um, 
Right, that's it. Oh, fucking hell. <clears throat> ah, keep an eye on these guys for your back. I, I watch it. I watch every fucking thing, seriously. And not just on here either. Not just on here. I get email alerts. If something's posted on the internet anywhere in the fucking world in real time, the minute it hits Google on millions and billions and zillions of pages, if it's through with Liverpool, I get an email through like that. I watch everything for everybody. I do really, guys. Mm. Right, we've got more stuff that I want to talk about. Um, to be, yeah, we'll, we'll crack on with that. If you appreciate this video, give it a thumbs up. All right, give it a thumbs up. Don't mean you agree with me. Just give me a thumbs up. Yeah, I like a thumbs up. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, girls? <clears throat> uh, leave me a comment as well. Appreciate the comments. They, yeah, I like the comments. I like the comments. Do you find this video helpful? No. All right, what do I mean, man? Fuck it. Let's, let's, let's just talk about uh, something else then. What else should we talk about? How influential Jay Spearing is behind the scenes of the Liverpool football. Maybe we'll do that. Yeah. Or should we talk about... Um, FSG breaking the bank. Yeah. Mm. I looked at my online banking this morning. I broke the fucking bank. Which reminds me, if you want to buy me uh, a coffee or a beer, hit that fucking super thanks button as many times as you want. Uh, drop me a comment. The comments are important. Please read the video description. Uh, sign up to the newsletter. Big plans for the newsletter. Um, but just haven't got time at the moment. Uh, how else? Yeah, I'm live at 3 o'clock on here this afternoon. 3 o'clock this afternoon, UK tab. Come on. Let's get the squad in here. I like it when the squad come in. You know what I mean? The channel members and the channel subscribers. Yeah. Right, okay. Uh, no, it's just like, it's, this stuff winds me up a little bit. Do you know what I mean? Because then people will come. I guarantee someone will come on the stream this afternoon if they haven't watched this video and say, don't have heard the finalising the thing. And it's not because they're trying to mislead. It's just they've heard it somewhere. Do you know what I mean? We do have a chat room if you want to uh, join us. I mean, I haven't, I haven't checked it. They're probably talking about it in there right now. Uh, we have a chat room, uh, which you know people from um, you see in the comments on here will be in there. Um, they're they're not very really talking at the moment. I suppose it's still early in the morning, but uh, yeah, it's cop talk chat. Uh, what you need to do is go to your web browser on your mobile phone or um, your desktop and type in T dot m e forward slash cop talk chat t dot m e forward slash cop talk chat you'll be prompted to download the telegram app which is free it's like whatsapp but free your number's private unless you choose to fucking give it to anyone i guess uh and you can join the the, the chat room and you know take part there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of people in there um and also t dot m e forward slash cop talk news so you get the news alerts when i send things out of interest um and if you do join cop talk chat I would advise you maybe mute notifications, otherwise it'll be go it will not stop going off at all hours as well. But it's a really good place to uh, for, you know get engaged with the conversation and uh, and to be you know alerted of when new videos like this come out. So I hope you uh, appreciate this video. I am just trying to help uh, tell you where that uh, claim has come from today. Should it pop up anywhere, uh, and I suspect that it will uh, pop up because I've seen the fans talking about it already. A couple of people have mentioned it to me already that I know, and I wanted to get it out there for you straight away that you should dismiss any nonsense by them fucking idiots uh, you know that are writing these uh, these articles all right guys see you in a bit